Hi, I'm John Backer, and I'm here to show you how to create uh, your digital business cards inside LFI Shuffle. First thing you want to do after creating your account is go to LFIShuffle.com. Uh, just like when you signed up, and then hit log in, you'll have your user ID and password, uh, but since I'm already signed in, uh, I won't see that here today. I took the option to build my first card coming right out of the registration process, but if you didn't do that, this would be blank for you, and I'll show you how that would look here in a second. But first, I want to show you that this very first card that gets created from your profile information, uh, it's a very basic card, but you can come in and edit it. So this first screen here gives you the capability of ch uh, choosing button color, changing your template, and there's a number of, of templates available that look look and feel different and some of them have uh, videos at the very top and if you've got a powerful video perhaps you should consider one of these templates but you can switch back and forth between templates this is one where you feature a, a product or service and uh, some have the picture uh, your picture at the bottom some have it at the top so let's let's just take uh, this one here, select this template. So there we go. So we were able to change the template for what we already had. Once we do that, we step through these five options. Now this is the way it looks on a computer. You can also do this on the app on your phone, but uh, it, it looks pretty much the same. So when we hit next here, we can change the card title, the name, the email address, the phone number, whether or not the phone allows text or not. So if you're using an um, office phone, you wouldn't want to have it saying that it allows text because you would never get the text messages. You can also put in the company name, job title, address. You can edit or add about text. And then you can toggle between showing your referral ID and the shuffle ad banner there at the bottom that I just removed then you go next again and you can change the photo which is this photo here you can change the logo which the logo is right here and then you can change product images there can be up to five of those and you can add images and, and change them at will once you're happy with the photos then you go on to social so if you use Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, LinkedIn, Google Plus, or Pinterest, you go to those websites, you pull the, the URLs out of your address bar, and you paste those in here. And those will light up the different uh, social media buttons on your digital business card. Then in communication, if you use Skype, WhatsApp, Snapchat, or Line ID, you can put those, those parameters in there. You can have up to five YouTube videos, or five Vimo videos, or five between the two of these services, um, in addition to having your YouTube uh, channel linked up top there. You can also have linked buttons where you put in the button text, and then you put in the website that you want people to, to go to when they click on it. Then finally, we have a confirmation. So let's go ahead and hit save here. We could have added and changed anything about our digital business card. Now let's go back in and, and preview it. So this allows us to see what the card looks like. And this is a pretty straightforward, simple card. But it, you saw all the capabilities that we have available to us. So it doesn't have to be that simple. So let's go ahead and delete this card. So if you don't have any cards created, this might be what your screen would look like if you didn't create your first card immediately after signing up for Shuffle. So here we're going to create a new card by clicking on this button. And just like we went through, right, we, we select our template. And you just go through and, and edit what you want to edit and the very first thing it says would you like to use your profile information um, we're gonna say yes and then I'm gonna show you where you can go and edit your your profile information 
and then we go in and make whatever changes we want to. Okay, yeah, I've got to put a card title. And you can just step through these, adding whatever information you care to add. Come back and edit it at any time. Hit save. And now we have our first digital business card again. So if you miss setting up your profile information, where you go to do that is you click up here where it has your name, you go into My Account, and you'll be in Profile. You click Edit to change this information. You click Edit, and you can change this information down here. And then you're, you're good to go. Uh, one of the most frequent questions I get asked is how do I create my first card? So we've gone about it a couple different ways now. So one more thing here. Uh, if you want to add another digital business card, in the lower right-hand corner here is a plus sign. That's how you create a new card. And without upgrading to the 100 card package, you can have up to 10. Once you reach 10, if you want to delete one, edit one, it's all up to you. But you can have a total of 10, each of which you can share with an unlimited number of people. Thanks.